just trying to get into the bugs because I've got the rock rebels coming in now any second now. And in fact, in fact, I hear something outside the door. Yes, come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. <laughs> there it is. Come sit down. Come sit, sit, boss, sit. Anybody, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the rock rebels. I've been talking to them all week. Sit down. And here they are. If they're sitting down, we've got PJ Powers, we've got Bobby Lowe, we've got Miles Shannon, we've got Denny Lalouet, Danny Antle, and Kevin Kruger. These are the hottest musicians on the block, I'm telling you. Anthea, you must listen to this band, I'm telling you, but you can't now. Oh, get some cake. Where's some cake for PJ and the boys? Here's some cake for you, PJ. You can, she especially baked it for All right, well, here we are. I'm now sitting, finally, 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 I'm sitting with the Rock Rebels. I've been talking about them all week, and I'd just like to introduce them all to you. Uh, in order of, uh, as we sit here, uh, here we have wearing lovely red today, we have PJ Powers, who everybody knows, of course, and loves the Stuckant and Stundecker. Sitting next to her is Mr. Bobby Lowe. Uh, he's done a million records. He's a star of some many, many, many uh, music specials. Right behind him, if you can see right behind Bobby's shoulder there, we have uh, wearing black, looking gorgeous today, is the bass guitarist in the group, Mr. Denny Lalouette. Next to him, if you can just be seen there, uh, in, uh, in the glasses, is Mr. Danny Antle. He's the keyboards man. And next to him is the lead guitarist, Mr. Miles Shannon. And wearing the cap, looking gorgeous today, in black also, is the drummer, Mr. Kevin Kruger. Thank you a lot. And uh, these are the people that make up the Rock Rebels. And I saw these guys at Fat Onis a few weeks ago. Yeah, and, and I thought they were just brilliant, these guys. I mean, they're the top musicians in the country. They're fantastic. Now, you all guys have all got your solo careers going. They're all music producers. PJ's bringing out an album, I think, in October sometime. Yeah, the end of the year, yeah. Yeah, the band is going to be recording also. Yeah. But you guys come together for fun, right? Absolutely. Uh -huh. That's right. Yeah, All got solo careers, but so, you come together for the Rock Rebels. That's exactly what it is. Bobby, tell yeah. me, how did the band get together? How long have you been going? Well, uh, it's been going about two and a half years now. And uh, we just got together because we wanted to have fun, play some of the old songs that we all enjoy, and some new songs as well, actually. Yes. So, yeah, we just have a lot of fun doing it. We play every week at a place called Fat Arnie's, every Thursday night out at Kyle Army overlooking the racetrack there. I like it. And, yeah, no, you must come and check you it out. That's where I met you a yeah. couple of weeks ago. That's I got right, you came, there. I came up at 3 o'clock in the morning. In fact, you were late there also that night. Oh, you got fruit. PJ, I mean, PJ, I mean, she can't hoi this woman, she can't hoi. I don't drink, what are you talking about? I didn't say drink, I said hoi. Oh, hoi, yeah. Because <laughs> now you got, you got your album coming out, you with, with uh, what, Scorpio music? Scorpio music, yeah, at the end yeah. of the year. And but uh, this band is a lot of fun and I enjoy being with this band. You should come and sing with us sometime. Well, I didn't, I didn't want to, I didn't want to <laughs> say anything, but, but you know, I, I'm thinking of promoting the band because, you know, I'm, I'm a promoter and if you need a producer, you, I'm an agent, I can hoi. But uh, look, uh, I have been a musician in my time. I did used to have bands at school, and if I'm no. going to promote you, maybe we can talk a deal. Maybe I can do a song with yeah, you. Yeah, maybe we could. Maybe Kevin, we could. so uh, tell me, um, uh, uh, do you guys have a record contract yet? Not yet. <laughs> but you're working on it? Oh, yes. Because you are all music producers in your own right. And that's where the trouble's going to start. <laughs> <laughs> I like it already. Now, the Miles, um, uh, 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 you when, play... When do we eat the cake? <laughs> well, well I don't know we? if you want to eat this cake, because the last time I had a bug in it, so uh, I don't know if you're actually too keen on eating listen, this cake that's yet. cake, I'm not having tea. But now, listen, um, <laughs> so you guys are in fact on his every Thursday. That's where you can be seen. Yeah. And uh, I've been there a few, a few nights with you guys. Miles, uh, 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 what, you, you were with a couple of bands before this. What bands were you playing with before? I was actually with mm. PJ and Hotline for a couple of years and I've toured with various bands. But now it's Fat Arnie's Thursday nights with Rock these Rebels. reprobates. Yeah. And uh, Danny, you were recently overseas uh, working know. on it's some uh, record deals there, yeah, I believe? We went to London and the UK and it was fun and we met some lovely people. London and the U.S. <laughs> <laughs> and Denny, of course, the bass guitarist. Now he's a, he's a French man. He's all the way from Mauritius. Now he's one of. The, now I, I've seen this guy play. I think he's a world-class bass player. Denny, I mean, uh, how is it that you got so good? <laughs> <laughs> when you're good, you're good. When you're good, you're good. A lot of work. It's what you do. But I'm not good yet. Good enough. You know? Well, with this band, I mean, the, when I saw this oak plane, I mean, I, I fell over because individually these acts are all brilliant. And, uh, and if I can get it right, I'm going to sing a song. What song are you doing for us today, Bob? Uh, it's a song from the 60s called Judy in Disguise. Have you heard of that one? I know it. I know it inside out. It. It's Judy in Disguise. Uh, my no, time. No, no, no. It's Judy in Disguise. Yeah. I know this That's song. That's the one. Yeah. That's the one. <laughs> Yeah. Judy Do you think I'll come guy. and sing with the band? Judy and this right? guy. Do you want to come and sing with the band? As a, on a sort of a trial basis this morning. Bobby, I would love to, man. Please. <laughs> let's let's give it a bash. Can I sing this song? You know, we get so many fans in adulation that she and I can't handle it all together, so we've got to share it with you, I think. Okay. Now tell me the kind of music that you guys are playing. You're playing from the 50s right to now, right through Absolutely. everything. And you're playing 50s, the old 60s, songs. 70s, 80s, 90s. 
You're playing the old songs like, but with now sound. I mean, Very much so. More harmonies oh, yeah. in than there used to be. And more chies. Is, is there, is there a big, is there, and more chies? I like more it. It's more hoi. Yeah. But even in the 50s we were playing it. Because yeah. we don't want to give away from it. Is there a big demand for the kind of music you guys are playing? Say that again, please, Vic. Is there a big demand for the kind of music that you guys are playing? I think there's a very big demand for it, yeah. You know, I mean, people that grew up in the 60s are probably now, what, in their 50s or so, or company managers, that sort of thing, and they like this kind of music. Yeah, I think there's a big trend yeah. towards going back to recording and re-recording old stuff at the moment yeah. as well. I mean, if you look around at the amount of young bands that are doing covers of the stuff that came out of the 60s and 70s, I think there is a yeah, lot of yeah, there is a demand for it. Well, I'm just saying, I heard you guys a few weeks ago, and even after a couple of brandy and cokes, you actually blew me away. I'm telling you that. And we well, got better and better. And you got better time. as a night <laughs> went on. I mean, the whole point is that the music appeals to the older people like yourself. And, uh, uh, sure. uh, as we're on the question of age, well, we'll be seeing the band later on. <laughs> this is the Rock Rebels now, with Vic Little being allowed to sing with them. I can't believe my luck. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And here it is. It's going to come in. Hoi volume. Put that volume up. Thank you. 